Oh, I'm sorry. There's this thing no, 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 that Kevin ahead. Hart says that says that goes, everybody want to be rich but don't want to put the work in or something he says like that. And I think that works in a lot of different ways. Like we want the success. We want unity. We want to be protected. We want all of these things, but no one wants to put the work in. Facts. And I think speaking of wanting to be protected, we keep talking a big game, but a big part, a big contention in our community as a whole. And just the community between men and women is, is always been a uh, a divide there. But it a big divide right now is this whole street harassment thing. Men act like it don't happen and women are, are literally telling you that they go through this every day. And we get on these this online thing and we argue with each other to say this is not happening to me. But this is the same thing. We are continually divided over the smallest of things that could be fixed and rectified if we just took the time out to fix it. This is the same argument we've been having about racism. Black people say racism is uh, racism exists. White people say it doesn't exist to me. Argument there, exist. like we all know it exists. We all see these things. Just like we see, literally, we see these women. Oh, a lot of women go through this street harassment thing, and we act like it's no big deal, or we tell them to get over it, or we're telling them that they're exaggerating. One of the arguments to bring this back around to Roe was, well. I seen her online stuff. Maybe she had an attitude. If she did, that doesn't justify being hit with a brick. Okay. First and foremost. But two, if she did have an attitude, after I saw these statistics and after I've seen countless woman after woman after woman after woman after woman either get hurt, be terrified, and talk about their experiences on Reddit, on X, on Facebook, on TikTok, in lives everywhere at what point do we look up at ourselves as men and say okay this is a real issue like how do you not believe them at this point if she had if a person a woman role for instance if she had an attitude when that guy asked her for the number how long has she been out how long has she been on the street today hmm did you ever think about that? Do you know how many times women, especially in bigger cities, get cat, cat called? You don't, because we don't go through it as much as women do. Men, maybe 20% of men has ever been cat called. I've been cat called like twice in my life compared to most women who get most cat called get... every time they go out the door. 